day one you will not simply practice you will not know where is the ground you will simply running ah huh? you running on the treadmill what what will happen if you run on the treadmill you will just stay there <laughs> isn't it so you need to figure out which ground you need to walk which ground you need to choose for so that approach is very very important i have been practicing but my listening is always stuck at probably 55 62 78 72 but never have i reached my desired score especially in listening so what i should be doing do you have any video that can help me understand that i should do these things just for a short period of time say 9 days and aim for that 90 then trust me this video is for you because i am inculcating a 9 day complete routine only for your listening so make sure you watch the video till the end hey everybody nakul from skills pt academy really hope everybody is doing fantastic I'm back with that another video today's video is all about a 9 day routine for a perfect 90 in listening is 9 day sufficient well if you plan it and put all of your time and energy not into the wasted resource but into the proper resource the real resource then yes man it's definitely possible i have not studied in english medium till my 10th no problem this 9 day routine is enough but you just need to religiously follow them everybody will not be able to follow this because i'm going to inculcate a lot of things the real stuff if you're up for it then trust me i'm i will promise you will be able to get that 99 days for your listening before we get into the video if not subscribe to this channel click on the subscribe button for the future notifications and any point of time you need online assistance you can whatsapp us on the number given there we will help you i'll be there my team will be there to guide you put you in the right direction i tell you a lot of students on an everyday basis are getting that 90 overall i hope you've seen the same in our youtube shorts and insta page as well all right so let's start with this 90 day routine let me just share my screen 90 day routine for a listening 90 the very first thing is let's understand what all modules contribute to listening pt listening is contributed from the speaking for approximately 40 to 42 marks from repeat sentence and retail lecture that means 50% of your listening marks come from speaking nakul i have speaking 90 nakul stop bullshitting this come to the actual thing and no it doesn't work like that you have speaking 90 only means you have speaking 90 it doesn't mean you're getting that 40 marks or 42 marks towards your listening from speaking it does not mean boss 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 it does not mean that trust me i'm telling you the truth okay summary spoken text will contributes five marks some cases five to seven marks let's say you have got less number of repeat sentence let's say you have got less number of right from dictation then perhaps summarized spoken text may get a little high priority otherwise four to five marks or five to six marks max to listening and listening fill in the blanks 10 or 12 or 15 marks depending on the number of questions you get <coughs> highlight incorrect words 10 or 12 or 15 marks depending on the number of questions you get and then the big boss right from dictation minimum 40 mark it could be more than that if you add it up to nakul i am not getting 90 that's where you're going wrong because you're putting your logic it doesn't work like this correct the, word, the way the software works is different whatever the number of marks they reduce it to 90 at the end of the day but we have to prepare for each repeat sentence with a lecture summarize spoken text listening from the blank highlight and correct words right from dictation just six of this if you're perfect you have to get 90 men but how to fix this six miss six things they're not that easy So nine day preparation plan. Let's start per day. You have got four hours. No, no, Kul, I have not got four. Then perhaps this video is not for you. I am telling you the fact. You have four hours. Just put in. I don't have four hours. Make four hours. Hey, why can't you make four hours, man? Nine days of sacrifice can't you do? I am not asking you to sacrifice all year. Nine days you sacrifice your sleep. I come back from office by nine p.m. Indian time. Then I have my dinner ten thirty over, no, Kul. From ten thirty to two thirty. Start enough. Nine days. Ten thirty you will have the result. Can't you do this? I hope you are saying yes because it's possible. It's all about so sacrificing and compromise. It's not convenience all the time, correct? Per day at least four hours, but if you have more time, you can definitely give more than this. Total duration nine fours of thirty six approximately forty hours. All right. <clears throat> so day one, what has to be done? Fix approach for all the modules. Recently, I made a video on. 10 day approach 10 day preparation plan for reading if you missed that out kindly check the video is somewhere here or in the description that's also very very nice video a lot of people have liked it have commented personally and texted me that make something on this of this sort for listening as well so here i am day one you will not simply practice you will not know where is the ground you are simply running huh? running on the treadmill 
what what will happen if you run out the thread you will just stay there <laughs> isn't it so you need to figure out which ground you need to walk which ground you need to choose for that approach is very very important day one you will not practice rather you will learn approaches for all the modules repeat sentence what is the approach i've told in many videos recently i made this three hour full course video the video is booming ranking number one you can have a look at it approaches for all the modules even repeat sentence it's clearly explained here also i'll do it what matters in repeat sentence nakul i know content content doesn't matter it's the fluency so listen to the audio speak fluently speak perfectly i'm not asking you to speak perfectly listen carefully repeat sentence i'll have a demo what is repeat sentence don't have to speak full even if 60% of the audio if you are able to give the content it's enough but 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 your fluency should be perfect so that's the approach fluency is the key fluency is the key fluency is the key what is fluency there should not be any the, the, the fumble should not be there no hesitation clarity should be there continuous speech should be there no pauses not much of the pauses content not much of an effort so the idea is when you understand the approach you will know how to practice are you practicing correctly are you improving everything you would know because you know what gives marks it is the fluency not the content and let me just play this audio listen to it education helps you develop critical skills like decision making and problem solving and now you are supposed to speak education helps you make decision making skills like critical solve my the it, this will be zero but people think who oh, have given half I have given some 60% complete zero because you fumbled you hesitated you you know paused and what not let's see one more demo education helps you develop critical skills like decision making and problem solving education helps you develop decision making and problem solving full marks no cool you did not speak half you spoke in parts parts but i was fluent i was very clear in what i spoke but i did not listen to the full audio i listened to this education helps you develop education helps you develop critical skills like decision decision making making and problem solving education helps you decision making and problem solving same fluency that 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 continuously i'm speaking i'm not fumbling only middle some parts i messed it up there were like 12 words i hardly i think i spoke some six seven words eight words i'll get full mark so this is the approach so now when you practice you practice for fluency not for content no nakul i practice to get that 100% i'll give you one more demo education helps you develop critical skills like decision making and problem solving education helps you develop education helps you develop critical skills critical skills what critical skills decision making and problem solving now people will say education helps you develop critical skills like decision making and problem solving they are like yes the party even before they see the result next day they wake up in hangover and see the result 45 overall they are like oh this is scam no you have not given what software wants you have you have thought you have given you are giving the content no mark it is the fluency if you fumble if you pause no mark so whenever you practice practice for fluency this is what you understand d1 hope you are getting it same way for all the modules will quickly check it out read a lecture fluency not the content not just the keywords listen to the audio take notes use phrases if possible keywords are fine in the worst case use phrases and your template and speak any template is fine i have given my template in that full course 3 hour video you can have a look at it how to do retail lecture everything don't worry about the grammar that's the approach what people do people try to fit the template into whatever they have written they have to it has to coincide it has to make sense and nothing for speaking it is the fluency now when you understand the approach when you practice you practice for fluency not for grammar not for number of keywords hope you are getting it so when you listen you don't write just listen 5 seconds and then 5 seconds you write and then 5 seconds you don't write listen for 5 seconds write for 5 seconds this is the approach in that 3 hour video i've clearly explained you can have a look at it and let's say this is what i wrote now using a template i'll just speak whatever i've written this is day one approach you will learn the approach i've written four small sentences the lecture gives the important key points and the relevant information about he has built a city in the beginning the speaker explained about he hails from aristocratic family later speaker mentioned about the importance of the sun sets down here the speaker was ideally pointing at the fact that the eyes and lashes come out in conclusion the lecture gives the important key points about he has built a city so this is the way you do it this is the way you do it but people don't do this whenever they practice the lecture gives the important key points and the relevant information about uh, he uh, ha has built, built a city this is zero 
Yeah, you spoke correctly. Zero means zero. If you do more than two, three fumble, directly zero. Don't think I spoke everything correct. No, you will be assuming. What gives you mark is not content. It is the fluency. Let's see this small demo. Hold on. Something like this the person has written. See the previous slide where he has built a city. He hails from aristocratic family. Grammatically correct sentence. But now, <coughs> The person has not written a grammatically correct sentence. He built a city. He from aristocratic family. The sun down, the eyes and lashes out. Entire grammatically wrong. So what person tries to do? He tries to fix the grammar. No mark for grammar. That means his approach is wrong. His only practice. He is running in the treadmill. What will happen? You will just be there. You will not cross any ocean. You will not go anywhere. You will just be there. The person starts speaking. The lecture gives the important key points and the relevant information about he uh, he he has has built built a city. Gone, Max. So now when you practice, you know the approach. What matters? Fluency. Practice for fluency. The lecture gives the important key points and the relevant information about he builds a city. In the beginning, the speaker explained about he from aristocratic family. Later, speaker mentioned about the importance of the sundown. Here, the speaker was ideally pointing at the fact that the ISIS sent lashes out. This is the way to speak. This is the way. But people don't realize. They only work on grammar that unwanted things. So day one. <clears throat> put some time to get the approach what is required what is not required grammar is not required this is required list it down and day two onwards i'll give you a routine accordingly you will practice <clears throat> and then summarize spoken text same as written lecture same strategy use a template but when you write no spelling mistake no grammatical mistakes nothing else same thing fix grammar and spelling what people do they have problem in grammar and spelling they don't fix they work behind template no template will give you mark man it's what you write inside the template person used my template and made 20 spelling mistakes got paid overall he came back and scolding me what is this you gave me template it's not working i asked him okay write in front of me an audio i'll give and he wrote full spelling mistakes <clears throat> so these people don't realize correct 60 70 word is enough don't cross 70 words don't write just 50 words uh, above 60 below 70 there should not be any spelling mistakes no grammatical errors this is what summary spoken text so when you practice every day you practice for this between 60 and 70 no spelling mistake no grammatical errors hope you're getting it hope you're getting it listening fill in the blank so this is nice Pure listening skills being tested. No, Nakulai, my listening skills are poor. Running on the treadmill. <laughs> you should know now how to improve listening skills. I'm going to give you day two, day three, day four, day five, six, seven, eight, nine. Hold on. I'll explain you each and everything in just a while. But the approach is listening fill in the blanks. Is listening skills and spellings. People think it is only spelling. No. Pure listening skills. What is listening skills? We will see. <clears throat> you have to use your grammar. For this, you need to learn grammar. Check my 10 grammar shortcuts. Many 4 to 5 grammar videos I've done of one hour. You can check in my YouTube channel. Learn the grammar. Sometimes in listening, fill in the blanks. The S sound. He develops this project. Developer develops. That blank is not clear. Using this grammar approach, you can identify this plural sound. I'm going to show you. Spelling is the key. So this is the approach. Now, when you know this, you will know what to practice. Let's see a small demo. This is listening, fill in the blanks. Hold on. Have a pen and a paper or something. Use your laptop or somewhere. Don't use MS Word. If you type the spelling automatically, it will auto-correct. All right. Let's see this small demo. Let's see how many of you make mistakes. And then I'm going to explain you what should be your preparation like. For that, here, you need to fill few things. What is that? I'm going to show you live. Just listen to this audio and answer the questions. Biology is the scientific study of living organisms and their interactions with the environment. It explores the complexity and diversity of life, ranging from microscopic single-celled organisms to complex ecosystems and the intricate workings of the human body. Biology encompasses various sub-disciplines, including botany, zoology, genetics, microbiology, ecology, and physiology. Through observation, experimentation, and analysis, biologists seek to understand the fundamental principles and processes that govern life. They study topics such as cell structure. Alright, you can pause the video. Just cross verify the answers. So, I'm going to help you understand. See here, biology is a scientific study of a living organism. Article concept. If a is not there, it should be organisms. Hope you're getting it. So, these are the things using grammar you can fix. So this, when you know, it becomes very easy. You don't have to worry too much. It's the spelling, it's the spelling, it's the spelling. Pay more attention. We'll just work it through 
Biology is the scientific study of living organisms and their... S is there. If you are not able to hear it, apply the grammar. A living organism. If A is not the living organisms. Second one. Interactions with the environment. It explores the complexity and diversity of life. Diversity. From microscopic single-celled organisms to... To... A complex organism. If A is not there, this should be plural. So, without even listening to the audio, I am telling you, it should be plural. Complex ecosystems and the... Ecosystems. If you don't write S, gone case. So, like this, there are some grammatical approaches. Anytime you need an online paid course, you can join. But if you don't want to invest there, totally fine. But you can learn grammar and try to apply. Because when you know these things, approach is very, very easy. Day 3, day 4, day 2, everything, you would know what to what to practice. You can see the increment. You can see the progression. Hope you're getting. So, answers are organisms, diversity, ecosystems, genetics and govern. So, here subject verb agreement is being used. Principles and processes that they eat. He eats. This is subject verb agreement. They just verb will come. He singular verb base will come. Here principles and processes are like they. They they govern, not governs, govern, yen, not is. So using grammar you can fix it. Sometimes people don't understand the word. Using context you should understand. And when you understand everything, your spelling goes wrong. Now spelling has to be improved. So these are the approaches for listening, fill in the blanks. And then we will quickly come to the highlight incorrect words. This is a pure reading skills. People don't understand. Pure listening and reading skills. We will see why reading skills. Read what you see. Don't. No, no, no. Cool. I will read what I listen. Sound waves reach first. Light waves are reaching late. If Einstein was alive, he would have shot himself. Because light waves are supposed to travel faster than the sound waves. But we are so lazy that the audio is reaching us first. We are not seeing it. We listen and read what we listen. No, no, read what you see. What exactly I am talking about, we will see. Uh, reading every day is the key. We will come to the routine, but this is the approach. When you know the approach, you would know how to practice. So, what is higher and correct word? They are going to give you a text like this. The plain audio. In the audio, few things are written differently. Let us say the audio is global change is a concerning global issue. What you heard? Global change. What you read? Climate change. What you heard? What you read? Both are different. During that, take a mouse and click on this, it gets highlighted in yellow. It's called highlight incorrect word. So, I'm going to play the audio. Let's see how many incorrect words are there. You can just count using the finger and in the end, you would know how many incorrect words were there. I will explain you how many incorrect words were actually there and how much you got and how many mistakes you did. Try it whenever you see an incorrect word, just count using the fingers. Let's see. Climate change is a pressing global issue that demands immediate attention and action. The Earth's climate is rapidly changing. Primarily due to human activities such as the burning of fossil fuels, deforestation, and industrial processes. These activities release greenhouse gases into the atmosphere, leading to the greenhouse effect and subsequent warming of the planet. The consequences of climate change are already being felt across the globe, with rising temperatures, extreme weather events, and melting ice caps being just a few of the visible impacts. It is crucial for individuals, communities, governments, and businesses to come together and address this challenge collectively. How many of you got this? Six were there. Perhaps you would have got four. Because what you heard, address. What you read, address. You are reading what you listened, read what you see. Advocate. If I just show you, you say advocate. If I play the audio and show you, you say address. This is the problem. If I just, we'll just play it again. If I tell you what word is this, you will say elements. Correct? If I play the audio and listen, you will say events. Because in the audio, they said events. You listen to the word events and read it as events. So, you should not read what you listen. You should read what is there. Just you can rewind the video and, you know, play it. There were six mistakes which people must have. Advocate, they would have missed. Elements, they would have missed. Something onto or into was there. Few were easy, it was easy. Uh, here, pressing or concerning global issue. Primarily, primitively. So, what happens is, see the word elements and events. E, V, E, N, T, S. Elements is E, L, E, M, P, N, T, S. Both of them almost look similar. So, we get twisted. I mean, we, we get faked. Correct? So, it's consciousness. Now, whenever you practice, you should practice for reading skills. Read a book. This is the approach. Just practicing on this every day is just like running on the treadmill. You will be there only. But you are running. 
okay so we'll quickly come to the day two and day three hold on for another one minute we'll come to the last model right from dictation pure listening skills and spelling skills no knuckle i'll only practice right from dictation no improvement can happen reality so how to practice we will see adding extra words add extra spellings everything will work it will work it will definitely work all my students are adding listening skills and spellings need to be improved so what exactly i meant let's listen to this audio the pandemic led to a significant increase in remote work across the globe the pandemic led to the significant increase in the remote work across the globe pandemic led to a significant increase in the remote work right online something so this is the audio the pandemic led to a significant increase in remote work across the globe one two three this is listening skill if there are 13 words and you tell your mind to you know take care of this 13 words your mind says oh, oh, oh 13 words if you tell the mind just three phrases it'll say oh only three phrases is it it's like a patient goes to a doctor and doctor asks him to take rest for 15 days patient is like oh, 15 days is not possible for me you know what my manager will be behind me a lot of work is that it's not possible for me to rest for 15 days the doctor says how about just two weeks he says oh just two weeks so totally fine that's what it is it's just a mind it just goes in a direction you ask the mind to so this is listening skill this has to be improved otherwise people will memorize four or five words they write second thing is spelling and strategies now you can add extra words the pandemic spelling i have a problem d-a-d -E, add both let spelling i don't know l-e-a-d l-e-d l-e-d-s to a significant increase increases increased increase Remote work works across the globe. Ye and the the ye ye. So this way you add extra words so that you get more marks. But simply adding extra words will not give mark. Listening skill, like I told you, the pandemic led to a significant increase in remote work across the globe. Or four phrases: one, two, three, four. Phase four. Sorry. <laughs> Listen, divide them, and write. This is the approach. If you are not getting this approach, simply practicing on your own is like running on the treadmill. So day one. This is what you convince your mind and relax from day two onwards. I'm going to start practicing. I'll not simply run on the treadmill. I'll decide where to run, how to run, how much water to drink while running, how much food I need to drink. You will be more conscious about everything. That's what day one will do. And many people, if you watch my video, the three hour video on full course, will actually get it. Now, day two onwards, you have to convince your mind to practice with that approach. For that, there are extra things that needs to be done that we will just talk day two rigorous practice begins if you see these are the five things that we talked repeat sentence written lecture summarize spoken text listening fill in the blank highlighting correct words write from dictation the one that i've highlighted in red they're easy man written lecture you don't have to practice every day once in a while summarize spoken text once in a while highlighting correct word is easy once in a while so these three don't give preference so leaving this out what are we left with Repeat sentence, listening fill in the blanks, right from the equation. These three are important. And these two, when you practice 40 plus 15, let's say 55 marks to listening done, to writing also done, because this contributes to writing also. Repeat sentence, 30, 33 marks, speaking done, listening done. Getting it right? So these three only on practice. But what to practice? How to practice and where to practice? The day two will give you the actual picture. Don't forward the video listen to it carefully another five minutes i'll not bore you more already i think 24 minutes done <laughs> very sorry but within 30 minutes i'll try to finish because from here the actual video starts repeat sentence take questions from any source any source doesn't matter download sound recording in the phone in the phone there is an app sound recorder it will record or you can record using zoom or anything it's a simple one Practice in the laptop. In the laptop, go to YouTube or any website, take the questions, practice. But before doing that, in the phone, I have a phone here. Okay. <laughs> One second. <clears throat> in the phone, I click record and just keep it. In the laptop, I listen to the audio, practice. Listen to the audio, 10 minutes over. Now, everything is recorded in the phone, correct? End the recording, play the recording. This is very important. It's not about just practicing. It's about knowing. Are you moving ahead or you're stagnant? See, I'm just running, but I'm here only. I'm not even moving. This will not help us. You should realize, are you moving? And when you are moving, are you moving backward? Backward also you can go. You have to move forward for that. You need this 30 minutes of repeat sentence where you listen to the recording and analyze. Don't uh, ask app to give you scores. It is 100% fake. Not exactly fake. What I mean is it's incorrect. Nobody can give you the scores. It's only Pearson and a person with experience. So here, 
how do you self analyze every listen to the recording any fumbling you have done to reduce one mark i'm not talking about content content if there are 10 words at least 6 words should be correct if there are 12 words at least 7 words should be correct some 60% of the content is matching plus if you have not fumbled then give one mark to that question now ko life spoken 60 70% correctly but i fumbled once how much marks i give zero so this way you practice for 100 questions if you have fumbled for each question it's zero out of 100 <laughs> that means you are not ready so out of 100 questions you have to score 90 for a 79 plus you have to score 70 for a 65 plus getting it right if you have crossed that 60% of the content matching plus no fumbling you fumble is zero crossing 60% of the words content matching and zero fumble then give one mark to that question if a fumbled give zero mark i have not fumbled but only 40% or 50% matching zero 50% matching is enough but everything you speak software may not understand so i would always suggest to be on the safer side 60% if it is matching 10 words 6 words should match 15 words at least 10 to 11 words should match plus fluency if any one of them is missing give zero out of 100 you have to get 90 above for a 79 70 and above score out of 100 for a 65 this will tell you 30 minutes a day you do it and see the magic getting it right you should practice for fluency then comes listening fill in the blank 10 to 12 to 15 mark take questions from any source let's say you practice some 20 questions each question has five blanks let's say so total 100 blanks are there your score should be 90 plus for 79 that means <coughs> out of 10 questions you can make one mistake hope you get it because this module is that important out of 65 let's say out of 100 blanks you get 70 blanks correct you are ready for 65 problem is i'm getting 50 blanks correct nakul i have exam tomorrow that's the problem so rigorously follow by ninth day there will be an increment hold on it is not just a practicing this additional secret things are there that i'm going to talk about in just a while and then comes right from dictation take questions from any source let's say you practice 20 questions each with 10 mark 20 into 10 200 mark now your score should be 185 plus every one word is one mark 200 words means 200 marks right your score should be 185 plus for a 79 i'm getting 170 you are not ready for 79 this itself will sell will tell For 65, 150 plus, something of this. For 190, for 200, 180, 185. You have to get it. You will get it. Apart from this, say pay more attention. We talked about 30 minutes of repeat sentence and 30 minutes of listening fill in the blanks. One hour and one hour of write from dictation. Pay more attention. Have given one hour here. So total two hours done. But I told you four hours. Another two hours. This is important. it's not just the pte it's also what you do outside the pte if you're already good in english then it's not required problem is we are not good in english including me we are learning correct so spelling test one hour of spelling test is what i would recommend you can download some spelling apps don't ask me i've never figured out but i mean i've never checked but there are many spelling apps i'm pretty much sure in the play store or you can go to chat gpt just hold on for a second yes it is slow so you will click here give me 100 spelling test it'll give man it'll give all the words you learn or if you getting bored then you give me give me misspelled words for me to correct accommodate accommodate as double c double m it's single c given believe i is missing calendar d e r d a r so this way you correct and then you ask show me the answer it's just that you need the passion and time in our course every day we have spelling test so far some tef 7000 to 8000 spellings done you want to join an online paid course we'll give you everything ready made we force you to go in a routine you don't want them make use of this it will give you everything one hour a day if you think your spelling is not good you have to do this is important and write down the wrong spellings revise them every day once otherwise you learn forget you learn forget very very important spelling is the key don't neglect spelling is the key listening fill in the blank write from dictation summarize spoken text summarize written text essay it's the spelling most important thing only thing that is important is spelling one never you have to give man come on if you're already good nothing is required if you're not then give 
apart from this one hour of listening to a podcast or a tv series in english i'm listening but not understanding the accent is different then get used to it no your youtube or netflix in the youtube you can type podcast about sports about life there are millions of them listen but when you listen in the setting option down click on that increase the speed to point 1.5 x rather 1.75 is what i listen uh, it's very fast if you think it's very fast you can listen at 1.5x but increase the speed and then do it otherwise not much improvement can be shown can be seen your mind should get used to this faster audio this is very very important one hour you need to do very very important and just relax and listen don't do anything and don't use subtitles so the idea being very simple from day 3 to day 9 sorry on that it's supposed to be day 2 to day 9 day 1 is fixing the approach 30 minutes of repeat sentence 30 minutes of listening fill in the blanks 1 hour of right from dictation 1 hour of spelling and 1 hour of listening activity this is the actual routine but like i told you whenever you do repeat sentence self analysis give one mark if you don't fumble and content is above 60% give zero if it is not matching listening fill in the blanks out of 100 you should get 90 plus right from dictation out of 200 you should get 185 plus and if you keep doing this for 9 days scientifically trust me on this one spelling improves listening activity improves right from dictation listening fill in the blank repeat sentence automatically improves so you could actually feel that oh yes i'm improving and if you're just doing this and you're not doing this running on the treadmill you're just here but you're running it's going forward this is very very important and since you're only 9 days i don't want to compromise on this one hour one hour you have to do it nakul i have 30 days then this 30 minute you reduce to 15 minutes 15 minute 15 minute this one hour probably 15 minutes listening activity 30 minutes so this way one and a half hour you can spare but for this you need time if you want that quick improvement then just follow whatever i have gave you whatever i have given you things will fall in place 9 day routine for a listening 90 here you go that i already finished hope this video you liked it if you want more similar content like this do leave a comment and if you really like this video like my explanation or putting all the efforts and giving the right information if you really liked it do give a thumbs up for this video and type after all i am a human i feel really good and motivated to come back come up with more videos something like this if i feel that my words are appreciated anytime you need online assistance you can text us in the whatsapp and don't forget to click subscribe button on this channel very soon i'll be back this is nakul signing off from skills pt academic till then take care thanks much bye bye